Bruce and Melanie Jarl Kubot here with West USA Realty and Arizona Retirement Communities. I'm out in Sunland Village going to give you a tour of your new home here. We're out here doing the home inspection, uh, so hang on to your eyeballs. Here we go. Okay, so this is the house, and as you remember, it's a north-south orientation. It sits on the uh, north side of the street facing south. It's a 300 floor plan, which is about 1,200 and I believe 87 square feet. Um, it's got a newer 25-30 uh, year roof on it. They did put a newer garage door on it. Um, very nice home. This is slump block in front, which is what most of these are. It's, it hasn't been painted. Uh, the, uh, they tiled this front patio area. Very nice. And they, they've got a, a very nice uh, security door on here. Uh, that's uh, real nice as well. You know, a home is, is in very nice condition. They've done a good job with maintaining it. It's got this Berber carpet in here. I think it would clean up real nice if you're not ready to start replacing the flooring right away. We do have the, the popcorn ceilings, but there's no cracks or settlement cracks there where the 300s had usually shown one. Uh, and so very good condition as well on there. I don't believe they're leaving any furniture. They are going to have an estate sale. Um, and uh, from my remembrance it's going to be December 3rd and 4th I think. So this is your dining area and then here's looking into the kitchen. Side by side refrigerator and uh, cabinets are very good condition. They're original cabinets but they are in good condition. They did replace the stove uh, and cooktop in here. Microwave sitting on the counter your food pantry and that little door down to the end. And this is tile in the kitchen here. And the tile looks really nice shape as well. And then here we're stepping in the laundry room. And then we've got cabinets above the washer and dryer. They're an older washer and dryer. They look good shape, but they're, they are older. And then uh, here's your uh, wash tub. We're going to take you into the garage here quick. i got to keep the video under 10 minutes, so we're going to uh, do it kind of quick here. But uh, you've got a nice set of cabinets here in the garage. They're built right in. And uh, what you may want to consider doing is insulating that garage door. The garage door is not insulated, and it faces south. It would help keep the house a lot cooler in the summertime. You can usually get panels in which to do that. There's your storage room. It's not quite wide enough to put a golf cart. You could get a golf cart in there if you took everything else out. Uh, but uh, let's see here if we can get the light on. There we go. You got a newer hot water heater over there in the corner. And, the, and you just wouldn't get a, uh, a uh, water softener in here. And then there's your water, soft water loop there where that box is sitting on there. And uh, you could put a water softener in if you so choose. Okay, so there's that wall of cabinets again. So the inspector's out here and he's taking a look at everything. He's going to get up on the roof, he's going to check the AC unit out and just make sure everything's up to snuff here. And so here's looking back towards the front door. And then walking down the hallway, that's your cool air return for your furnace filter. And that's a storage closet. Looking straight ahead to our guest bedroom. And our uh, guest bathroom is right here. Left, uh, you know, high-rise toilets, the cabinetry is very good condition here again. They do have carpet in the bathroom, so tiling it would be nice. The uh, tile around the bathtub and shower is uh, really good condition. It's kind of a... a uh, I don't know, darker tan color. And then here is the uh, guest bedroom. They're using it as, a, as an office. They've took off for the afternoon and, uh, and we'll be back in a couple hours after the home inspection is done.
The guy is just getting started, so I don't have any news for you on that end. So we've got a coat closet before you enter the master bedroom, and we have a linen closet uh, right there next to the door as well. And then here is your master bedroom. And here is the master bath. Just linoleum in here. It's a newer linoleum in good condition. Low rise toilet again. But then uh, here is the shower. Shower just needs to be cleaned up. You maybe maybe decide to replace that shower door, but the tile is in good condition in there. It's just kind of dirty. That is a medicine cabinet where that mirror is. And uh, uh, that, that I've seen them do some nice things as far as paint with that. And a lot of people will pull off these uh, bedroom doors and closet doors and uh, and paint them white and it sure makes a nice change on it. You do have a ceiling fan in this master bedroom and you did have one in the guest bedroom as well. So we're going to take you back out. You've got a ceiling fan in the dining room here. And we'll take you out to the backyard. I had a long weekend in San Diego guys so uh, my mind isn't uh, in the mode of working yet so I'm Mixing my words. <laughs> so I'm standing out your patio door and I'm looking to the west. These are your neighbors to the west of you. And then this hedge back here, that is the neighbors to the north of you. They do a nice job of keeping it up. Sure gives you a lot of privacy for the backyard. And then this is looking to the east. Again, guys, if you've stumbled into this video by chance, uh, visit my website. I specialize in selling homes in active adult retirement communities. You can visit my website at www.justjarl, that's J-U-S-T-J-A-R-L.com, or you can give me a call at 480-710-6326. Uh, Melanie and Bruce, I hope this uh, video kind of helps you out here, and uh, you uh, call me if you have any other questions. Again, my name is Jarl Kubat. I look forward to meeting you in person, and I appreciate your business. Thank you.